sometimes films are not as we remember them and that's okay but it can be quite disheartening to rewatch a film for the first time in a while and not have that same delightful experience that you used to and this has recently happened to me with the film Ghost Town. This is the 2008 film directed by David Buck and this stars Ricky Gervais as a character called Pincus and we'll talk more about him in a, mo- in a moment. We also have Greg Kinnear as Frank. We have a really great cast. There are a lot of, uh, having said that I'm not the biggest fan of Ricky Gervais, but in terms of talent, really great cast. And there are things I like about this, but watching it again, it's not as good as I remember it. And I, I can't quite work out if that's because I'm misremembering it or my tastes have just changed. But this was probably one of my top 10 favourite films for quite a while. Primarily because I love films about the afterlife where people die but then are... Well, that's actually not the case here, but um, where we have spirits interacting with the human world in a comedic setting. That's something that I love. I guess this became one of my favourites because at that point I hadn't actually seen that many. I did see this in the cinema and I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Not so much now. So this is about Bertram Pincus, Ricky Gervais's character, who is undergoing uh, a minor operation. And he dies on the table for seven minutes. He wakes up, he, he is alive, he is fine, but he can now see ghosts. He sees dead people. And these ghosts, most of them, are taken advantage of that by approaching him constantly and asking him for favours to communicate with the loved ones they've left on earth to help to ask him to help them with unfinished business and something you need to know about Pincus is that he's not really the nicest of people under normal circumstances he is quite grumpy and keeps himself to himself but not not in an endearing way just in a really standoffish way So obviously having all of these ghosts coming up to him while he's trying to contend with the fact that he can see them and then that he died for seven minutes when he learns about this, his character becomes increasingly infuriated and confused and it is quite a joy to watch. But it quickly gets old and I find that, you know, the narrative really interesting. I really like the concept because usually with ghosts on Earth, it's the ghost who is trying to resolve unfinished business with those who are living but he died and is now alive and he is the one kind of like a middleman almost and you know I think the development of the narrative is really interesting it's something that I quite enjoyed it's something that I enjoyed you know way back when when I watched this 13 13 years ago my goodness but I think now the character of Pincus is so unbelievably annoying that I just can't get on board with that character. And it's not in the way w- with a lot of films where you know you have a an antagonistic protagonist, if you'll excuse that oxymoron, but you, you're rooting for them. You're rooting for them to change their ways and get better and you know see the error of their ways and, and look for the light. But with him, I just didn't care. I did not care at all. So I don't really know. Um, I'm not really sure if I felt, I I don't believe I felt that way back when. So I feel like maybe just my tastes and characters have changed. Maybe I've just become a lot more bitter as I've aged. That's certainly something that I'm very willing to accept as a strong possibility. But it also makes me think that there might have been films that I watched years ago that I didn't like, that maybe now I would like. And I'm always willing to give a film a second chance. So in a way, although I'm slightly disappointed by this, this made me want to revisit some, some, maybe some of the more popular films that I just don't get on with and see what I think. I don't regret having rewatched it. I'm not too disheartened by the fact that this film I loved for a long time is now not a favourite because it stopped being in my top 10 a very long time ago. But had it been still a film that I cited as a great film, yeah, I, I'd have some questions. Ghost Town is not a bad film. A really interesting narrative. Um, you know, really great special effects, lighting, the colour palettes, the set designs, everything looks amazing and I have no issues with the acting. I just think Pincus as a character really ruins it, considering it's all about him. 
kind of an important factor. I would recommend it, but definitely not as much as I used to.